got something better to do than run round after the brigadier. Just me or do people around here look extra shiny today? And I don't think it's a moisturizer thing. Hey, fancy doing a little Torchwood mission for me? We got word that the Nestine Consciousness has taken over a plastics factory not far from here. Long story short, the Nestines like playing with their human-sized action figures a little too much. And they brought a bunch of shop window mannequins to life to cause mayhem in the streets. Help me take these dummies down, will ya? printer, I could clone myself and take me out to dinner. That's all of them. And if I may say so, you were looking pretty good out there. If you fancy catching up later on, you know where to find me. Must 
say this is not the kind of weather that I had in mind when Jenny suggested a short holiday. Good day to you. Such a relief to find someone else here. I'm afraid I got stranded here after a failed experiment with a device that the doctor refers to as a vortex manipulator. To make matters worse, I seem to have stumbled upon an ancient ice tomb belonging to the Cybermen. Of course, they're still snoozing away for now, but I was alarmed by the sighting of a number of Cybermats making a nuisance of themselves. If you can help me get the little pests under control, then we won't have to deal with their rudely awoken masters. How intriguing. It appears as though our cyber friends are being awakened by their little ones. Skills never occurred. This shouldn't require anything more than a little I hope you're up to it, my dear. All of these little pests must be stopped before the Cybermen become fully active again. We could really do with speeding the process along, my dear. I don't wish to alarm you, but our cyber friends will soon be a win. Those Cybermats don't stand a chance. Strax would be very proud of you. I do believe that's the last of them. What a marvelous Those Cybermen will be tucked away asleep in their ice tombs for quite some time yet. You would be very welcome to join my little household with Jenny and Strax. The Paternoster Gang's door will always be open to you. Now, if you'll excuse me, I really must be getting back home. I dread to think what Strax has been up to in my absence. I must say, this is not the kind of weather that I had in mind.
Oh, <laughs> 